Hi, I'm Mark Manis, Director of Instruction at the Golf Center at the Highlands, and today I want to talk to you about how to deal with this shot, the buried lie in a bunker. It's not that different from your regular bunker shot, but there is one significant difference. In a normal bunker shot in the sand like this, I'd probably open my club face, meaning the ball's sitting on top of the sand, I want to get a light cut of sand. Well, this time the ball's buried, so I need to make the club dig, and the way to do that is to turn the face in. So, we have this buried lie. I'm going to set up to it like I normally would. And I'm going to close the face about 45 degrees. And then I'm simply going to take the club back and hit down. Ooh, that was pretty good. I barely popped that one out of the bunker. What you should notice is that I didn't take a huge swing. I didn't have to swing terribly hard. I used the club in the manner in which I'd set it up, this closed face, to get the club to dig beneath the ball and push the ball up. It's one of the properties of the sand that I really like. I'm going to show you real quickly how this works. This is how a buried lie works. When I get in the bunker here, if I turn the club face in, because the leading edge of the club is closed, it wants to dig more. It gets down into the sand. Well, notice as I push down, the ball comes up. So follow through really isn't all that important. Key to this is to hit close enough to it to get enough energy to the ball and notice that as I push down, as I'm going down and going forward, the ball didn't go left. It doesn't go where the club face is going. It goes more where the path of the club is going. That's a critical element in this shot. So the truth is the buried lie isn't near as hard as we think it is. It's a normal shot. We're going to hinge our wrist, take it up, kind of slam the club down into the sand close to the ball, and let the sand push the ball out. Using the closed club face, that club will be able to dig enough to get the ball out of the sand. One more time for the fun of it. Oh, get up there close. That was a pretty good result. Get in the bunker, bury a few, turn that face in and have a go at it. Kind of note where you're hitting the sand. I guarantee you practice this a little bit, you'll give up on all that fear in the bunker. I know this will help you.